a line intersects two parallel lines. Uh, okay, so let's just do that. Here's my two parallel lines and lines intersecting them, forming four acute angles. One, two, three, four, and four obtuse angles. Okay, obtuse, one, two, three, four. The measure of one of the acute angles is 9x minus 560. So all of these are 9x minus 560. Uh, the sum of the measures of one of the acute angles and three of the obtuse angles, okay, and three of the obtuse angles is negative 18x plus w. What is the value of w? Okay, so uh, first what I would do is that I know the sum of these has to equal 180 degrees. So these two together is 180. So therefore, to define what the obtuse angle is, it would be 180 minus 9x minus 560. So minus the acute angle. And that's true for all of them. OK. So then if I have that and it tells me that the sum, wait, so the sum of the measures of one acute angle. So we have 9x uh, minus 560 and three acute angles. So we already defined what our three acute angles are. Uh, da, da, da. Let me just simplify this one further. I could keep it as is, but to make our lives easier, that would be um, 180 minus 9x, uh, 560 oh, plus 740. So this actually would be 9x plus 740 degrees is what that simplifies to. So it'd be 9x minus 560 plus 3 multiplied by 9x plus 740, and this is all equal to the sum that they provide, negative 18x plus w. So, and then simplifying that, 9x minus 560 minus 27x, and oops, 3 times 740 uh, plus 2,220 equals negative 18x plus w. And then I need to do everything. Well, do the math. So negative 27 plus 9 um, equals negative 18. OK, so this would be negative 18x. And then we have 2220 minus 560. Um, okay, so plus 1660 is equal to negative 18x plus w. The x's are going to cancel, so I get that 1660 is equal to w, and there's our answer. Hi, guys. I'm Jackie. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please be sure to like, comment, rate, and subscribe if you like this video and you want to keep getting more amazing SAT questions. Thank you again, and have an amazing day.